The American Society of Agricultural and Biological Engineers' 15th historic landmark designation is the Massey Harris No. 20 Self-Propelled Combine, the first commercially successful self-propelled combine. Until the McCormick Reaper of 1831, the harvest and separation of grains was a manual operation. Threshing devices invented in the 18th century led to the development of the threshing machine. The grain harvesting process was highly labor intensive. By the 1930s, field machines like this 1938 Massey Harris Clipper had been developed that combined the reaping and threshing operations into one machine called a combine harvester or combine. The combine turned field grain harvesting into a one-man operation. In 1936, company director James Duncan set a goal to develop a commercially successful self-propelled combine. Tom Carroll was chief engineer for the team to develop the self-propelled combine. The number 20 was tested in 1938 in Argentina after only eight months of development. The 16-foot machine was somewhat heavy and expensive to build and was not the complete answer to competing in a high-volume market. But the number 20 did successfully establish the concept of the self-propelled combine and became the basis for future combine concepts and the ASABE historic designation. The number 21 model, tested in 1940, was lighter and lower cost. Massey Harris rushed the design into production just as all design work on farm machinery was frozen by the government. World War II created high demand for food and fortunately the North American farmers responded with record grain harvests. The government limited production of farm equipment to 33% of 1940 because of the need for steel and other materials for war production. Massey Harris convinced the War Production Board that building 500 combines for a harvest brigade would help the war effort. The goals for the harvest brigade were ambitious. Each combine would harvest 2,000 acres, 15 million bushels, and release 1,000 tractors for other use. The results of the Massey Harris Harvest Brigade exceeded expectations. Over 1 million acres and 25 million bushels were harvested. The Harvest Brigade introduced the custom cutter process for harvesting grain where custom operators move their combines throughout the season. An ASABE historic plaque for the Massey Harris No. 20 self-propelled combine is displayed at the Henry Ford Museum along with a restored combine.